Continuing the YouTube series about the really interesting origins of street names in Jerusalem. A really good book just came out on this topic. I think it's really interesting. So many of the streets in Jerusalem are named after really, really interesting people and it's easy to just kind of walk through the city without pausing for a moment to wonder who were these people. So uh, the street I'm on today is called Patterson Street. It's a very, very small street. In fact, it's only about 100 meters, maybe 200 at most, running between Emek Refaim over that way. The Orient Hotel is right here on my right. And behind me is Derek Beit Lechem, which in English, is Bethlehem Road because it travels in the direction of Bethlehem. John Henry Patterson was born in Ireland in County Longford, but one of the great non-Jewish Zionists who contributed extraordinary things to the state of Israel. John Henry Patterson was born in County Longford in Ireland. He joined the British Army when he was 17. Both of his parents were not Jewish. One was Protestant, one was Roman Catholic. He had a fascinating career including getting uh, sent off to Kenya, where his job was securing the construction of a bridge for a railway. And that project ran into difficulty because of the fact that they were man-eating lions who were eating the construction workers, literally. And uh, he successfully fought off the lions and earned commendations from far and wide for his bravery to the point of literally fighting off lions personally himself. But the reason that there is a street named after him in Jerusalem is because of later service. He later went on to serve as the commander of what's been called the first Jewish fighting force in 2000 years. Um, the uh, Royal Fusilier Corps and later the Jewish Legion that some decades later became the Israel Defense Forces, the IDF, Israel's army today. Really, really interesting character who basically forewent his own chances of promotion in the British Army in order to raise a point about the mistreatment of his troops who were suffering from anti-Semitism from higher ranks in the British Army. Uh, he was friendly with the late father of uh, Israel's incoming Prime Minister, Benjamin Netanyahu. Ben Sion Netanyahu was a noted historian himself, as well as Jabotinsky. So he mixed and mingled with the greatest Zionists of his day. Uh, and he was originally born, like me, in Ireland. He died eventually in California at the age of 79. And there was a decade-long operation to have him reinterred in Israel to fulfill his wish to be buried here in Israel with the men that he commanded. That was eventually after an enormous, uh, complicated process of the state of California allowing the excavation of his remains, having it brought back to Israel, being buried in the Abi Hayel ceremony in his, a cemetery in Israel where some of his uh, former soldiers are buried. So a truly fascinating Christian Zionist. Interestingly enough for the street names of Jerusalem, this area where I'm standing in, which is broadly called the German colony, has a number of street names after notable Christian Zionists. Many of their stories are told in the Friends of Zion Museum downtown. And as I continue with this series about the street names of Jerusalem, I hope to be able to tell more of their stories. So Patterson Street, little alleyway between Amak Refaim and Beit Lechem Street, right next to the lovely Orient Hotel. And now you know why it's named after Patterson.